Looking at Japan, we see an incredibly successful economic superpower. But despite all we see on the surface, Japan remains one of the most spiritually impoverished nations on earth. Japan's population is 126 million. Of those, only a quarter of 1% are evangelical Christians. The Japanese church doesn't have adequate numbers or resources to evangelize their own people group. Believe it or not, what this means is that according to the Joshua Project, the Japanese are the second most unreached people group in the world, second only to the Shaikh people of Bangladesh. But did you know that every year in Japan over 35,000 people take their own lives? The same pressures that led to Japan's success are leaving a trail of hopelessness and despair. Right now in Japan there are only four married couples from U.S. assemblies. Two are in their 70s, one is in their 60s, and there's my wife and I. So we're asking ourselves, where is the next generation of U.S. Assembly missionaries to Japan? I'm convinced that at this point in history, the Japanese people are a unique target for missions outreach. First, they're the largest unreached people group completely open to missionaries. Second, here in Japan, freedom of religion is guaranteed by the Constitution. Third, the Japanese government is one of the few governments left in the world still issuing missionary visas. And finally, what this all means is that here in Japan, I can share my faith anywhere, anytime, any way I choose. Please pray for gospel work in Japan generally, but also prayerfully consider investing your own life as one of the next generation of missionaries to Japan. The door here is wide open.